So hey guys, welcome back to my channel for tutorials. So guys, today I'll teach you how I create this type of beautiful concept art scene with using cycle render. So guys, that's my pyramid. It's really simple and best for beginners. And guys, see that's my simple render setting. Okay, so first of all guys, I show you my preview. That's my preview. Right? Okay. So guys, go to on here, create new. And click on here and guys select all and press delete key. So first of all guys, I'm going to take a plane and plane size increase like a 30. Enter. See guys, that's my scale size 30. Okay. So next one, guys, I apply segment. So go to on edit mode and right click subdivision. And guys, increase number of cuts and one more time subdivision and increase like this. Yeah, simple, right? Okay, so now guys, I create sand. So guys, this time I apply subdivision surface. Yes, that's it guys. Okay, so now guys go to on render setting and render engine. I use cycle render and feature set to use experimental. Yes, and guys device, I use GPU. Okay, so guys, see that's my viewport. I like one to eight is good and Final render 256. Actually, 512 is good. Yes. Right. Okay. So now, guys, go to on here shading. And guys, I create sand. So, guys, select and create new. And guys, little bit up. Yes. Okay. So, guys, go to on here. And now, guys, firstly, I apply displacement. Displacement here. And connect with displacement, yes. And next one, guys, I apply Vorni. This one, texture, Vorni texture. And connect with height. Yes, see, guys, that's my height. Okay, displacement. Guys, but see, guys, that's not correct. It's really flat. So, I increase depth. So, guys, go to our material here. And, guys, go to last setting. See guys, that's my displacement and use displacement and bump. Yes. Okay, so next one, guys, click on here. Yes, see guys, that's my displacement. Right. Okay, so now, guys, this time, select and guys, I apply mapping. So press control T. That's my mapping and texture coordinate. Okay, so now, guys, go to on displacement map. Guys, I decrease this mid level zero. Yes, and go to one up and see guys that's my scale like a 0 0.25. So here scale 0 0.25 enter. Yes. See guys, that's my sand. Okay, so guys, I increase smoothness. So guys go to on Ronnie texture and apply smooth F1. Yes. See guys, that's really simple. And guys, scale size, you can change like a 4. Actually, 5 is good. Yes. Right? It's really good. Okay, so now, guys, go to on layout. And guys, I take camera. And camera check. So, guys, go to on here. And up. Guys, press 0, camera. Yeah. And guys, select your camera. Guys, angle 90, 0, and 0. Yes, and guys, y axis change like this. Okay, so guys, go to on here, render preview. Yes, guys, select your camera and set your camera angle a okay, little bit up. And guys, closer like this. Yes, right. Okay, so now, guys, I apply sun light. So go to on here, world property. And see, guys, that's my color to change sky color. That's my sky texture. And click yes. Okay, so guys, strength half 0 0.5. Enter yes. See guys, that's my sun and sun rotation randomly change like this. Yes, right. Okay, so now guys, I change color. So select your plane and color change. Guys, base color. Guys, use sand color like a 0 0.07 and 0 0.9, 0 0.9. Enter. Yes. 
See guys, tags man, really cool. Sand, it's really simple, guys. Okay, so now, guys, I apply this time some objects. So go to on here, and guys, this time go to on add and apply landscape. Yeah, guys, I change landscape presets, different style of preset, but I like this one. Yes. And guys, go to on closer. Guys, I change seed. See, guys, that's my random seed. Like a change, like seven is good for me. Yeah. And increase scale size. So, scale size increase like this. Yeah. And press zero. And guys, set your that's my like a rock. Yes. And press zero. And guys, click on here. Yeah, and little bit down like this and increase yes see guys that smell like a rock okay but guys I don't like this one edge so height so guys select and increase height like this height increase uh, and next time guys you can change this size actually edge Okay, so guys, I use Sculpt tool, so select your landscape and go to on Sculpt mode, check. And guys, I take this one, Bloom brush and guys, increase brush size. So guys, now holding control key and guys, add change like this. It's really simple. See guys, that's match. Okay, so guys, here and here also and guys go to on here backside backside at change yes see guys that's my simple Okay, so guys press 0 and click on here, render preview, yeah. And guys go to on object mode, select. Guys go to on down, like this, yes. See guys, that's my, like a rock effect. And go to back, little bit. Yes, press 0, yes, much better, right. Okay, so now guys, I apply material. So guys, same, I use blender kit. And guys, click on here and type rock, enter. See guys, that's my different style of material, but I like this one. Rock 05 and apply. Yes. And guys, click on here. Okay, so now guys, before material, change UV, select. And guys, press tab. That's my edit mode. And press A, selection on. And press U. U for umbrella and use unwrap check. Yeah, that's it guys, simple. Okay, so guys go to on object mode and apply again material like this. And guys click on here. Yeah, see guys that's my like a rock effect. It's really good for desert. Okay, so guys press zero and guys click on here one more time. Yes, much better. See guys that's my really cool composition it's looking really good and now guys i apply more objects like this and guys rotate randomly rotate like this yeah and guys little bit down yes and guys click on here final render preview yes really good okay so now guys my desert scene is really good and next one guys i apply pyramid so guys use again blender kit so click on here and type pyramid enter see guys that's my free object so guys apply simple drag and drop yes and increase scale size like this and go to back guys rotate your pyramid like this and press zero yes good right Okay, so now guys, I apply one more pyramid like this and simple drag and drop. Yes, 
So guys, select second one and scale size change like this. Yes, more. And guys, go to on back like this. And guys, yeah, it's good. And rotate your pyramid like this. Yes, really good. See guys, that's my composition. And guys, click on here. Render preview. Yes, it's really beautiful. Okay, so now, guys, my composition is really good. And guys, I apply more. This one, that's my rock effect. And guys, select. Guys, you can apply a different style of rocks. It's depending on your work. Yeah. And increase like this. And guys, you can apply more. Landscape. Different style of landscape. And guys, change like this. Like a mountain. And increase this size. Guys, subdivision. I like 256. Actually, 200. 200 and 200. Yes. And guys, increase height like this. Yeah. And now, guys, increase scale size. Same. Yeah. Much better. Okay. So, guys, now, same. Press tab and select all and press U and unwrap, check. Yeah. And, guys, I apply same rock material. And, guys, go to on here. Rock material. Yes. And, guys, press zero. Set your composition like this. Increase. And guys, go to on here. Yeah. And guys, now duplicate. And go to on back. Guys, this time increase more height. Like this. Yeah. Really good. See guys, that's my cool composition. And guys, again, final render preview. Yes, much better. See guys, that's my beautiful composition. And next one guys, I apply simple trees. So guys, same, blend the kit and type tree, enter. Yeah, see guys, that's my different, different style of trees. So, but guys, I like, like a, this one, that tree and simple drag and drop. Yeah, really good. And change scale size, select your tree and scale size change. Like this. So, guys, go to on here. Scale size change. Yeah. So, guys, click on here. Find render preview. Yeah. It's good. Guys, more. Smaller. Yes. Okay. So, guys, apply tree on this one rock. And, guys, more. Press Ctrl C and V. And apply more. Yeah, like this, and one more time. Yeah, really good. See, guys, that's my really cool trees. And now, guys, I apply 3D character model. Guys, I have 3D character model. You can download 3D character model from my website, it's free. So, guys, go to on folder, select, and guys, scale size chain like 0 0.1. So import, yeah. See guys, that's my 3D character model. And guys, rotate. But guys, you can use any 3D character model. It's depending on your work. So scale size, change. And up. Like this. And guys, click on here. Final render preview. And guys, set your 3D character. Like this. Yeah, it's good. And guys, little bit more rotate. Okay, so now guys select this character and apply material. Create new and create black material. Like this. Yes. Really good. See guys, that's my really cool character. And select a little bit down. Like this. Yes. Much better. Right? Okay, so guys press 0. And guys see, that's my final one. It's really looking good. So guys... Select your render setting and denoise check. Yeah. See guys, that's my final one. So guys, I show you my final render. 
for the noise and check and see guys that's my final render it's looking same like this and guys click on here yeah okay so guys that's it my final tutorial is finished so if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you